first i was gonna say the next chapter but of course first we're gonna be heading back to the ship which is a good time to of course purchase some upgrades as well uh looks like we brought the robot along look at that he's just flying along with us that's awesome it looks very cool it's great to be back in my robot body again <laughs> you're creeping me out <laughs> Where i come from robots don't talk but sir we all talk and I'm nothing to be afraid of. I like how he says he's creeping him out. Yet, friends. look at all the creatures that he's hanging out with. Did he look in the mirror lately? Yes, it will be a pleasure. As soon as the captain gives the word, we can go. Okay, excellent. So let's pick up some of the coins right here on the ship before we head into the room for upgrades. And of course, we found a discount ferry as well. So we're going to get stuff even cheaper. So that's great. Here we go, getting all our upgrades done, or picking up coins so that we can get our upgrades done. Here we go. All right, let's head inside and see what awaits us here for the prison break upgrade. Welcome back. Ready for another magical upgrade? Certainly. Upgrade me. Okay, so looks like we've got the super crystal shard, which is pretty much the only thing we can afford the crystal eruption which looks absolutely epic look at that thing press b to summon a damaging ring of crystals around you that's a good attack to get rid of enemies as they're surrounding you emerald energy beam energy beam attack does extra damage chain reflections split energy beams split again if they pass through a crystal shard and crystal jams form at defeated enemies Ooh. Okay, let's purchase our first upgrade and see how things will go. So just a sec before I actually do that. What does it say? Summoned crystal shards have increased damage. Oh, okay. So this is just an increased damage thing. I don't even use the summoned crystal shard thing much. But whatever. Let's let's purchase it. We're going to need it anyway at some point. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Orangey type of color. I don't even know if that's exactly orange. But that was a cool little upgrade. Oh, yeah. Wait. Uh, did we get any more money on anyone? I forget. I don't think we did. So... It's pretty safe to head forwards, I guess. Uh, let's see. Let's visit the ship here. Take a look around. All right. If you happen to find anything out there that might bruise up the old girl, just come back. Certainly. Yeah. So of course we. Uh, I did put on the uh, skull masthead just because I thought it looks very cool and cooler than what we had previously, which is basically nothing. Right there. Let's just the tire. So I put on this awesome dragon looking thing. It looks very cool and I like the way it looks. So uh, I put it on there. All right. So let's head out. We can go uh, upstairs here. Maybe go for a little game of... Uh, uh, what's that game called again? I, why do I always forget? Sky Stones. There we go. All right. Look at all this stuff up here. Awesome. Okay. Before we do that, let's head back to the top again. Uh, can we break this? Oh yeah, look at that music. We got some music for us. Awesome. Prison break busting a move right here. Alright. Look at all these fairies flying around and such. Very cool. Okay, so let's head to the top. Play some sky stones. Maybe a one round of sky stones would be kind of fun. Alright. Here we go, going to our little, I like to call it the gambling area, because it does resemble a casino quite a bit. Okay, looks like this guy's selling some good stuff here. Let's see what he's got to offer. Arik, of course. Let's see. Okay, let's see what you have today. Alright, so looks like he's got a brawny barbell charm. A charm that helps giants lift boulders more quickly. Interesting. We've got some uh, areas and challenges that you can purchase, which is uh, very cool. But those are way out of our price range right now. We got a bowler hat, a balloon hat, which I did promise to purchase. So this is what we're going to be saving up for. The balloon hat, and then uh, we'll see from there what we purchase next. Ooh, look at that, an Archean Duelist. That looks like a very, very useful Sky Stone. So maybe we'll purchase that somewhere down the line. All right, so let's see. Certainly. I am I am taking up your challenge. Here we go. Nice little break here between between chapters. All right, that looks like a good little squad of stones for us to play with. Okay, so he's gonna start up with a weak spiderling, but we shouldn't underestimate him. Um, let's see. I feel like this would be a pretty safe move, but. 
course, he could have a piece that is going to attack us from the side there. And then we're screwed. But we'll see what he plays. Yes, exactly like I said. Excellent. Okay, so. Uh, let's see. What do we want to play now? We could take over his piece. But we would definitely put ourselves in danger. I think that this is the safest move we could play. Because it would keep us safe. As well as allow us to... Take one of his pieces, which is excellent. There we go. Now we've got three to one. He's going to play again on his own piece there. So, let's see. Uh, if I play this over here, will that cause... I think it would. So, I don't know if I want to risk doing that. Um, I could play this, but then if he has something strong to play over here, we're screwed. Let's see. This is intriguing, definitely. An intriguing little uh, battle here for me to decide what to do. Huh. Okay. Should I risk it? Should I risk it? Let's risk it. Let's risk it. We're going to go for the risky move here. And hopefully it will pay off. Let's see what he can play. Okay. Excellent. That is exactly what I wanted to see. Um... Now, I could go for... Well, I might as well go for the safer move and just uh, win the match. That's it. There's no way for him to win. No matter what he does, he's going to lose by one piece. Nice. That was a very powerful unit there. That Mohawk. Skystone was very strong. Okay. What did he reward us? He gave us a chompy number three. He looks very cute. Look at him. He's like, oh, I'm going to bite your freaking head off. Okay. They think you've still got the beginner's luck. But you still haven't faced me well, Skystone. Well, so come back again I did beat you, didn't I? Didn't I challenge. beat you? An extra challenge? I think I could still beat you. Now, this looks like it, it is pointing to the fact that you need a darkness uh, skyline to get through. So let's try that. We're going to put Cinder on here and see what happens when we do that. All right, Cinder. Let's see what you got. We're going to try to make it through this door. Okay, so it looks like now we need Earth. So we got Tree Rex to take care of that. I guess we're going to need uh, one of every kind. But the problem really is that I only have... I, I don't have Fire. And I do not have... Um, what's the other ones that I don't have? I don't have the mechanic one, like the robots or whatever it is. I don't have... I don't think I have any... Oh, look at that! Oh, that's awesome. Okay, who do I want to reward that all to? Uh, let's see. Uh, who do I want to give all this amazing money to? Uh, let's give some of it to Pop Fizz. I think that would be kind of fun. We could upgrade him. So that's awesome. If you didn't know, you can open up these three doors and uh, be rewarded with an amazing amount of coins here. Yeah, let's give them all to Pop Fizz. He deserves it. He deserves it. Our little buddy over here. He's got 245. He's got his awesome hat. Look at that hat. I love that thing. Okay, uh, we can in fact give him, I think, a different hat, can't we? Uh, do, 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 do. Where is all our hats? I forget. Actually, I think it's over here. Yep, wrong button there, my bad. Okay, so we got the purple fedora, the mariachi hat that is currently on Tree Rex. Let's see. Maybe we'll give him a little bit of a cooler hat if we have anything to offer. You got a flower fairy hat. I think the fedora is pretty awesome. So I don't see anything that is... Well, the plunger is pretty awesome as well. But the fedora, I think, will do well so far for him. So we're just going to keep the fedora on. Let's take a look at some of his upgrades. He's got the potion lob, which looks very cool. Look at the art on that. That is awesome. We've got the beast form. Press X to drink potion and temporarily change... In well, we have these ones. Oh, okay, so these, I guess, are the upgrades. We have these ones we don't have yet. So we got the new, conco new concoctions, which is press B to switch. Sorry, guys. I just ate my bad. Uh, press B to switch to some new potions, which have different effects when thrown. Interesting. Puddle of pain. Press B to cycle to a new potion that leaves a damaging puddle of acid when thrown. Ooh. Raging beast all attacks in beast form do additional damage. Throw potions and grab new ones much faster. Very good. That would be very useful, I think down the line and look at all these other upgrades that we can get potentially mutant beast and beast form press b to perform a special attack based on which potion is active Ooh, very cool so pop Fizz is almost like the most super powered uh, not the most super but like kind of like almost um, the most similar to a super powered character i guess kinda, like do you know what i mean does that make any sense okay 
why don't we actually play as Pop Fizz, focused up on the next, next up, chapter. The vault of oh, great name there. You ready for all these secrets? I'm so ready, bro. Come on. You mad, okay, bro? Just hop in the giant robot and I'll set you down. Sounds good. Sounds like a plan. So it looks like we're going to be heading to the Secret Vault of Secrets. The most original title for a chapter ever. Chapter number six. Uh, very cool. Let's see what happens here. As we head so to the secret, are, vault the secret Vault of Secrets. Thank you for the ride, dude. Hey, oh, look at you. Can it be a secret if we... Oh, never mind. Exactly. Don't question things. Just go with it. The actual vault itself is at the other end of the canyon, and it's completely underwater. I guess underwater secret vaults were all the rage 10,000 years ago. Probably. Anyway, the only way we're going to be able to get in there is if we can lower the water level. Ooh, look at that. That is cool. Do we get to drive the robot? This is amazing. Awesome. Oh, that's awesome. Hey, looks like something triggered Come on. The Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Don't Come here. These guys shoot us. Ah. Shoot them instead. Okay, Here's I'm trying. Button. Ah, okay, so I aim with the left Ouch. stick. Interesting. See something cool? Press the secondary attack button. Okay. Yeah. Cool. That is one powerful punch. Oh yeah, look at that. Walking through stuff like a sauce boss. Ouch. Hey, behave yourself. Things. Come on. I'd like to blow that up. Ah, this is awesome. I'm trying. I'm trying it. Oh, okay. Well the punch. The yeah, the punch, punch works much better. <laughs> okay. There we go. Oh god, look at that. Did you see that? That was cool. We just caused a major shockwave. Awesome. Each one of those enemies is That is so cool. We get to drive a giant robot. Okay, come here, sucker. Let's break through this little tiny bridge. It's got nothing to offer against us. Alright, there we go. That destroys them. And let's go after the helicopter that brought them to this party. Alright. So it looks like we're right at the entrance to the busy area here if i may say so myself all right here's the first generator all you need to do is route power to the dam ah okay so i need to hop off i Once think right happens, you can open the dam from the other side excellent i'll meet you over there okay can't we just smash through it though i wonder huh Ooh, look at that we just got rewarded with a whole bunch of goodies Ooh, look at that, an Archean bomber. I don't think we've dealt with those guys before. All right, we got some chompies to deal with. We've dealt with these fools before. They are of no match to us. All right, time for us to go mad, Fizz. Here we go. Time to do some big damage. All right, do we need to pick this up, or how does that work? Okay. Ooh, looks like I placed that counter back inside. Oh, okay, so you got to be very, very quickly about it. Excellent. All right. So, hey, stop throwing stuff at me. Stop it. Behave yourself. Bomber, Archean bomber, whatever kind of bomber you are. You still have to behave yourself. There we go. That takes care of you, sucker. And we leveled up. Thank you, sir. Level 4 Pop Fizz. Awesome. Very, very cool. Alrighty. So, it looks like we're going to need to smash both of these. So, we're definitely going to need to make sure that our timing is just right. I got one of them. I got five seconds to hop down here and get the other one. Excellent. So now the pat. Oh, God. Come on. Hurry up. Whew. I got nervous there because he started turning back. And I was like, oh, oh we won't have enough time. But thankfully, we did. Because Pop Fizz is freaking awesome. All right. Hopefully, at the end of this chapter, we'll be able to upgrade Pop Fizz, which will be very cool. Okay. So it looks like we need to reroute this generator. Which I am not... Oh, okay. Excellent. We just need to mash Y. I thought we need to blow it up. But this is even more fun and simple. Power. There we go. Look at that. That's so cool how the power transfer from light bulb to light bulb. Very cool. Uh, well, except for the part that is probably going to electrocute us. And we got to avoid it. That's not very cool at all. Okay. So, here we go. Let's be careful this time. All right. As soon as it goes, we follow it. Oh, God. Yep. And I just failed instantly. Oh, come on. No, darn it. Darn. I just let myself get hurt there twice in a row. Come here, sucker. Nice. Thank God. All right. Got to be careful again. We're going to wait till it comes back, and then we'll try to walk along with it and avoid getting electrocuted, of course, because that's the part that is most ferocious. Okay, here we go. We've got to be very careful. 
And make it all the way across. Oh, come on. Darn it. Oh, God. Now we gotta deal with two of these guys. And when they hit down the floor, there's electricity coming down. Darn it. Come here. Oh, God. I don't want to get surrounded. I don't want to get surrounded. Get out of my way, Chompy. As much as I like you guys, you gotta get out of my way. Ooh. Look at that. I killed... Oh, I thought I killed them both in one shot. I was, I was so excited. I was like... Oh, look, I did something very cool. Oh, I did do something cool. <laughs> I just caught his bomb and blew it up on his friend. That was a, that was cool. I like that. That's a cool little combination that you guys can do as well. Nice. Okay, good. Now we got ourselves a little platform to hop on and a pretzel to chew on while we get there. So this looks like a point where a giant could jump from. So we'll definitely do that in just a second. All right, so... Um, well, let's get rid of... <laughs> Look at that poor Chompy. He came down and he got surprised. Okay. Here we go. Excellent. I'm not really sure where the other point is of activation. That is. Ah, Darn. Okay, I did activate them all. However, I do want to uh, explore this little area first. So, we're going to summon our buddy Crusher. 